Hi, I'm Stu with Taro, and this afternoon I want to talk about ticks. I consider ticks to be the most dangerous bug in America that we all face. Some of us more than others. Yeah, if you're up in the Northeast woods, you know what kind of concern you have. In Missouri, deer ticks, big problem. Lyme's disease, number one problem. Tick-borne meat allergies, they're rare. You know, one to three percent, but they're really problematic. That's where the, the tick bites you, and then you literally become sick after eating meat. Tick-borne meat allergies, and then tick-borne ehrlichiosis, another blood problem. So ticks are nothing to mess around with. When you go out in the woods, if you're in an area that's known to have ticks, make sure you have a good layer of clothing and personal insect repellent, okay? Because you don't want to pick up any of these. Now, if you're in an area too that ticks are invaders into even lawns, that's where this product comes in handy. And I suggest doing it monthly. And so you've got, in, the, in, in our backyard with our garden, I'm gonna stay off the garden because ticks don't do vegetable gardens. But these shrubs and back and along the lawn areas where we occasionally come out, that's where I'm gonna treat this. So it's a hose end product. Put the hose up, you know how these work. You turn the hose on, flip the switch, and the product is siphoned up and goes out with the water. Don't do it if it's gonna rain within a few hours or the next day. Try to wait until you've got a couple days of dry weather. Apply the Tick and Flea Yard Spray and give yourself really another line of protection against this dangerous pest.